And good morning, ladies and gentlemen. This is Mr. Kasarian, and welcome back to Seven Days to Die. All right, how is everyone doing today? Good, I hope. Good, glad to hear it. Because uh, I found two things. The first thing I found was the crossbow schematic, and the second thing I just found was the riddle of steel. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know how I got this. I think it's kind of cool that I did. On the other hand, I'm like, a trash pile? Really? Trash pile? You know? Anyways, um, both zombie spawns, by the by, and uh, zombie difficulty have been turned up uh, just in time for day 14. Um, now, because I'm on an extended time setting, I'm not certain if I will get the seven-day horde on time or not, the day 14 horde. Uh, I'm kind of hoping I'm not, because my base isn't really prepared for this. Um, I mean, I guess if, if all else fails, what we can do is we can kind of book it, and uh, I can spend the night in my underground base over there and just be very, very quiet. Um, but yes, I'm actually very happy, because I now have the uh, crossbow schematic, and I have everything I need to also be able to produce some ammunition. I can't produce gunpowder yet, so the amount of ammunition I can get is still going to be pretty limited. Um, but it is going to allow me to reuse some of the other equipment I've gathered. And also, I'm wicked happy just to have the crossbow, too. Um, because that will be very nice to have. Uh, I'm loathly that around, but I don't really have the inventory space. As you can tell, I'm hauling back a lot of the stuff from my uh, base out there. So my inventory is kind of full right now, um, unfortunately. So yeah, we're going to just kind of run back towards home. Uh, let's not break a leg. How about that? You know, it took me forever to realize that those are actually rabbits screaming, not zombies. I'm like, well, I don't think I've gone long enough to generate a screamer yet, really. Yeah, well. Ow. Friggin' cacti. Hey, that was good. You know, I think one of the problems I have is I actually end up leading my targets too much. Um, you know, that would be... Well, here's what we can do. We can do this, this... Then that. There we go. Brass is going to be wicked useful for us, so let's just get back towards home. Yeah, as I was saying, um, zombies, zombies are pain in the neck. Zombies just are. That's the only way to say it. Empty purse, empty... Okay. Yeah, I didn't think those probably had anything in them, because they're close up to my base at this point, but, you know, empty weathered sports bag. Yeah, okay, so this is all. Yeah, it's a pile of glue. I don't really want to deal with that right now. Hey, I'm not going to kill you, because, um, yeah. Hunting rifle parts and an empty can. I want these hunting rifle parts, because they're in good condition. Let's scrap that first, and then... Uh, what can I leave behind? Um, um, I'm going to be do a dumb thing. I'm going to leave my arrows behind. Because we just got the steel book, so there's really no point. And also, come to think of it, uh, we also now have the uh, crossbow. So I'm not really going to be using my bow much anymore, I don't think. You know, there's no point in using the bow once you get the crossbow, so... And the crossbow is still wicked OP. You know, everything I've heard from everyone around has said the crossbow is still just as OP as it used to be. Um, it's just stupidly OP. Actually, I don't know if it's OP or not. I mean, I guess as a as an item on its own, it is OP. However, as a... I'm loath to use this, because then I'll be dropping cans places. So let's just... Let's just keep moving. Let's get home. It's right now it's more important just to get our butts home, not, you know, kill lots of zombies. I mean, if I generate too much of a conga line as I'm running, I'll take care of it, but, you know, honestly, for us now it's more important just to get home and safety and start making ammunition, honestly, than it is for us to do anything else. So that's what we're going to do. So yeah, I grabbed a lot of stuff. Um, that battery is nice, going to be nice to have. If for no other reason than, you know, batteries are good things to have. 
Uh, yeah, so this base. Um, we're going to have an issue because this stuff needs to be upgraded further. And I really don't have the resources to do it right now because I haven't really been focusing on getting them. So, yeah, we might be screwed. Um, again, if I think I'm not going to be able to make it, I'll probably, you know, retreat and hide in my hidey hole. All right, so let's get rid of some of this stuff. Um... You know, hold on. Pump shotgun stock, shotgun short barrel. All right, I'm not entirely certain what this even really needs, but let's get the wood planks out. Because we're going to have to make ourselves another chest or so. Actually, what do I need to make for the weapons, the storage weapons? I need crossbow bolt, right? A typical crossbow bolt, I guess, maybe? Do I just have any stones laying around? I should. Yeah, we go, small stones. All right, and then we should have some sticks laying around somewhere. Or not, apparently. Interesting. Okay, uh, so let me get some of my inventory cleared away here. Um, ba -ba 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 -bum. Let's put you away. Let's put this away. Swap that around. We'll put these away. We'll put this away. These away. First aid kits can go away. No, they stack up to five only. Interesting. All right, so let's open this guy up again. Let's take that out. Put that away. All right, so open this guy up. Put that away. And that away. Hunting rifle barrel stock parts. Can I make a hunting rifle yet? Nope. I could probably put it together. I probably have the parts to do it, but... Okay, so first things first. Uh, let's get this going, shall we? All right, so I have steel now, I guess. Um, that's good. Um, so if we look up steel... Arrowhead mold. Requires me to have a steel arrowhead. Okay. So a steel ingot mold is just some clay down there. So let's go craft. Steel ingot mold. Cool. Uh, I think we're probably going to go with iron for right now. Alright. Which one to use iron? That's lead. And you are iron ingots. Okay. So let's see. How am I going to do this? What's the best way to do this, guys? Uh, well, first of all, we're going to make ourselves that crossbow. Let's look up the recipe for it. So I need one and two are those leather strips, I'm guessing. So let's get that. And let's get ourselves some animal hide. Put that down there. I see one, two, three, four, five, six, seven sticks. That's a poor quality crossbow. We could do better than that. We could do better than that. Hold on. Another poor quality crossbow. Seriously. I know I can get up to decent quality here. I know I can. One seventy nine, one twenty nine, one twenty one, one fourteen. What's my maximum? Two ten. All right, I guess the one seventy nine is probably about as good as we're going to be able to get, to be honest with you. Yeah, I guess so. How did I get that bow? I must have found it somewhere, I guess. Uh, what do you guys do? Do you burn? I don't know. Alright, so we'll just... Chuck you guys on the ground, then. Okay. So that's good. Uh, we should probably get some iron arrowheads now. Yeah. I'd rather do steel arrowheads, but I haven't found any yet. So we'll just use iron arrowheads for this. Alright, so let's go open this guy. Take you out, put you in, put you in. And that should cook down. 
Okay. Uh, we also need to get ourselves some more chests here, too. Right, I also want to do this. Alright, so then we need some storage weapons, right? Hey, look, level 17. Let's make sure this door is closed. Alright, let's get hurrying with this, shall we? Okie dokie. Alright, uh, for right now, we'll just put it right here and right there. Alright. I'm trying to be calm as I do this, by the by. <laughs> trying. Do, 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 do. There's zombies downstairs. That might very well be the Day 14 Horde, to be honest with you guys. Do, 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 do. Don't mind me, zombies. Just getting ready to deal with you. Hold on for a few minutes. Give me a couple seconds here, guys. Hold on. We're working on it. 95 arrows. Yeah, it should be decent enough. Okay, let's get the rest of this crap out. Do, 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 do. Anything else we need to move around in here? Ah, uh, instant move too. Do, 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 do. Okay, so that looks good there. Alright. Other stuff we need to do. We need to make some more bullets. Alright, so what we're going to do is we're going to take apart some of these 10mm bullets. Or not, apparently. Okay. That's fine. Hold on. Alright, so let's take some more clay here. Craft that up. And let's take part one of our 9 millimeters then. Bullet tip, gunpowder, and bullet casing. And what we're just going to do is put that there. Now, it just so happens, by the by, that bullet tips are about the only thing you can actually do with the plan. Alright, so let's take... Split that put that in there. We're gonna have to move quickly here. Hold on. Yep, we're, we have to move quickly. Okay, that's no big deal. No big deal whatsoever. Alright, Iron Arrowhead. Hold on for a couple seconds here. Oh, I have some steel arrows in here. Oh, okay. Iron arrows. Can I... Can these be disassembled, actually? Apparently not. Okay. I wish they could be. That would make my life easier, but apparently not. Okay, so that's that, that's that, that's that. We'll put the scrap iron away, too. We have a barbed club in there. Alright, so... How is this going over here? Oh. They're not really busting their way in, which is surprising me right now. Uh, wood. There we go. Why did I make these again? What was I just doing? Oh, right, this. Okay. Alright, so we'll do that, that, and that. Crack those together. Thank you very much. All right, so we should be looking a lot better now. 
Um, actually, let's do this. For safety and security's sake. We'll do that. How are you looking? Uh, you still need fuel, don't you? Yes, yes, airdrop. I understand there's an airdrop out there. I'm a little busy right now, Dan. Come on, 32. There we go. Alright, so now let's go... Okay, here we go. Alright, let's get out of here. I think they just figured out I'm here, guys. <clears throat> and I need food. Oh, that's bad. Uh, beef rations look good. Wait, what's my health and stamina? I didn't die recently, did I? Huh. I realized I was still making up a deficit back there. Okay, so we're going to engage these guys in the open, I think. Um, that is probably the best idea. Hopefully I don't break a leg here. Nope. Okay, we're good. I could have sworn that I thought there were more of you. Like, I really did think there were more of them. Unless most of them died off on the spikes, but... Interesting. Okay. So, apparently I was wrong. I thought there were more of them there, and there actually were. Okay. Interesting. Okay. So let's get a repair tool out and let's actually start repairing this place. So yes, we can now actually make decent amounts of armor, right? Which is probably a very good thing. Unfortunately, we can't really repair this stuff. Um, oh, right. I don't have to... Eh. Oh, that's so nice. A little to the left there. <clears throat> right, it still does that. Okay, we need to finish repairing this stuff, though. We also should probably, now that I think about it, put some extra spikes out if this is the Day 14 Horde coming up. Okay, apparently that's not going to work. All right. Again, into the shoulder. Really? You know, shooting the crossbow, I really wish they'd just fix the... Thank you. I really wish they'd just fix the uh, aiming zone, because that's going to drive me insane. Alright, so we have all these spikes out. That's good, at least. Most of them aren't upgraded yet. I always think that one was upgraded and it got broken back down. So that's unfortunate. Okay. So here's what we're going to do. Um, let's see. How much wood do I have? Good, 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 good. All right. Well, let's get these. And I'm still figuring out where my point of aim is on this thing. There we go. Much better. Okay. 
Uh, we want to break this down too. Perfect. Okay. So we're going to want to re-upgrade all of that equipment there. That's great. Um, oh, hi. Oh, come on. Really? That was a great shot. That wasn't, and I knew it wasn't when I first pulled the trigger. There we go. That's better. A little low, apparently. Eh, we'll just kill you off this way. There we go. Coffee beans, and some more pipes. Good. Hey there, buddy. How are you doing? Not too bad, I hope. Now, you took damage, but you weren't damaged by the spike. That's interesting. Okay. So let's, uh, yeah. All right, so we're going to have to finish upgrading a lot of these then. All right, but what we're going to do is, besides just upgrading them... Let's see. Are there any other big holes in my defensives, defenses out here? I don't think there are. Most of this looks pretty good. And this is a pretty hard area to beat through. Yeah, okay, good. So what I'm going to do off camera, I think, is I'm going to be working on upgrading these. Uh... Why don't we get some, while we're out here, why don't we get some wood? From about the northwest, right? Right. So let's get some wood from up there in the northwest. That should be pretty decent. Okay. Nope, apparently not. All right. You know, I upped the difficulty. I really did up the difficulty out here. Well, you can tell I, I upped the spawns at least. Yeah, you can definitely tell that I have to up the spawns a little bit. There we go. That's how we do things. There we go. Alright, let's get going. Uh, yes, yeah, so we're just going to chop down some trees up here, I think. Thank you. Please die again. Thank you. Please die again. All right, let's just go chop down some trees now, shall we? So I'll upgrade those spikes. Uh, I'll spend as much scrap iron as I can on upgrading them. I may convert some of the iron I have back into scrap iron. Um, seems like a decent enough idea to me. Let me uh, not be where this thing's going to fall on my head. Do 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 do. Chop down some trees. It's actually a good thing, by the way, that I'm not doing this anywhere near my main base because, again, this generates heat. All right. There's my timer. Because this generates heat, and that uh, heat is bad. Right. Heat is bad. Heat is bad. Right. So we're gonna grab that, and we'll get one more. Thank you. Have a nice life. Okay. Let's finish chopping this thing down. Yeah, heat will cause more zombies to generate. Hey, big guy. How's it going? I think that was a little high.
Remember that they do like to try and sneak up on you. Uh. There we go. Game lagged for a second there. Alright, anyways, guys, this has been Mr. Casario, and I want to thank you all for watching. As always, this has been fun. Um, I hope you've enjoyed watching this as much as I enjoy playing this. Anyways, guys, see you soon in the next episode. Uh, yep, and until then, guys, good hunting and good luck. Would you just die already? <laughs>